What's up guys? Team Warman's here. And we got Ben here. Got top eight with the Aqua Forces. Aqua Force. Yeah, Thomas. Is that Maelstrom? I, I wish, I wish. Maelstrom but doesn't you... have a good Link Joker matchup. But so but Thomas does. Yeah, Thomas does. Alright, so um The best starter ever. Yeah, Bubble Drake. Well, I mean for Thomas. Uh, what he says is, uh, you act, you put him in the soul, pick something, and every time that thing swings at a vanguard on the fourth attack or more, you draw a card. So your turn two could be like you drop your hand, use it on a title assault. You get your like hand back. Couple dagger, anything, vanguard, title, title, and you draw two, and it's great. So he's just like an early or late plus one. And so uh, it is a Thavas deck. So I'm running four Thavas. Uh, he's Thavas. No SPs. I mean, he's not Maelstrom. He's Thavis. So, uh, I think you should all know what Thavis does. His GB2 says, um, when he attacks on the 4th attack or more, he gets a crit and you can't guard with zeros. And his on stride skill says, whenever anything attacks on the 4th attack or more, uh, on the 4th attack only, uh, you pick three of your opponent's rear guards, they pick one of those three and retire it. Yep. And it's great because it's free. And always remember, guys, that it's on the 4th battle on anything because some people, because they're misprinted. Yeah, they are misprinted. All of them are, even the SP one. Really? Yeah. Good job, Bushy Road. Um, the other grade threes are, and I only run three Skyros. Skyros, Skyros. Yeah, he says, uh, GB1, your whole front row gets resist, and when you ride him, pick something, and whenever that thing attacks on the third attack or more, look at the top five and add a grade three to your hand. So if you did it on Tyler, you can do it twice. Yeah, it's a good card. But uh, most of the time you want to run Thavas, not because of Thavas, but because of his support. Which we but you only to. ride Skyros when you see Link Joker. Yeah, or your guys are getting shit on. Uh, so, this is Aqua Force, so we're running four title assaults. You have to. Don't run less. Yeah, this card is a, uh, a free second attack. So if you play him and you have a Vanguard that's already three attacks, his second attack won't always hit, but if you have a 7k booster, it goes 9 and then 11, which uh, is good. An early game, if you hit a crit, you pretty much win. Oh early game is insane. So, like, uh, title salt's a must. Uh, then we have four couple dagger sailors. This card is amazing. Every time you open this card and anything else, you are happy. If you open this title and any other card, this becomes a plus one instantly. This this card's amazing. This is the card Aquavorce players have, like, wet dreams over. This is, this is a beautiful card. She even has purple hair. It's nice. Um, you and purple hair. Blue hair, but you know, I do what I can. Um, a lot of decks run three, which is perfectly fine. I like four because I like that early game. I only run seven grade threes. Um, then in this, I was running a build that I didn't really want to run, just because I was missing two of the Thava stride at the time. So um, because of that, I was running two Magnum Assault. I have since taken them out, but uh, the build I was running there ran two Magnum Assault. He never was useful. He was a ride target. Yeah, he was the ride target because he doesn't do much. <laughs> so that's him. And then uh, the MVP grade two is the Glimmer Breath clone. Yes. She is actually She's broken. amazing with the Thavos stride. Yeah, 16, so 16, 16. The play is like you um, stride, stride into Big Thavos, play her any, play her in the back row usually. Use his skill on her, so she's 16 swinging twice. If you hit a trigger, she's 21 swinging twice. If you hit a crit, she's 21 One swinging twice with a crit from the back row. I mean, like, she just combos with it. She's like, this. these two cards are the reason why your Link Joker matchup isn't an instant lose anymore. Um, so, yeah. Glimmer Only Breath, MVP. Only cheeky SP. Yeah, you do what you can. So I run um, four of the old perfect guards. Yeah, well, Justin Bieber. I mean, I paid 20 bucks for him back in the day. I'm going to run him. Um, you don't really want the unflipper ones because you may want a perfect guard at Title Assault and you don't counterblast that much. And you have the crit trigger that unflips. It's just less optimal to run the other ones. That's pretty much it. Um, you're running four of the Thavis Grade 1 because she's also busted. And she has resist. And she has resist. So, so if you're on, the, um, what's his name again? Um, Skyros. And you have her behind her, they can't big crunch you or they, and they can't roof flare you because yep. the whole column has resist. Yep. They have to or pick one unit. She says, when she, if you have Thavis um, as your Vanguard, so that means you could be on Skyros and stride into Thavis and it works. When she swings on the third attack or more, counter blast one, a uh, draw card, and she gets plus 5k. Um, now that's not once per turn, so if you're doing a Lambros play and your uh, heart is Thavas, you can draw two cards off of her. Yep. Which is very, 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 very good. Although you'd probably win if you're Lambrosing. Um, I only run seven grade threes, so I am running four stride enablers. That way you can search for Thavas and stride. He is a stride enabler. 
That is that is all. Um, and then in the newer build that I'm now running, I'm not running this in the older build. In the newer build, I took out the two Magnum Assault and put in two of this. It's a lot better. You get early game. Yeah. So the triggers are um, four Supersonic Sailor for unflipping damage. It helps if you like are just missing one Counter Blast for a combo. Sometimes soul. Sometimes it's soul. Rarely. It's rarely, but when you have these yeah, two, when you have it's, the it's very rare, but it does come up. Yeah. So, um, Supersonic Sailor is a must. Also, uh, the Margol clone is actually broken in this deck. It's not broken, but it's it's almost stronger than every other Margol clone because it's an Aqua Force card. And the Link Joker one just is good. The Link Joker one doesn't go on a title assault. But the Link Joker one makes a unit that's in the front row 13 become 16. You're not wrong. But this goes on title assault. Anyway, this goes on title assault. And the Margo one is helpful for Sanctuary card. <laughs> I mean, I guess. It's a great zero. Then you're running um, four of the Thavas crit because you're running a Thavas deck. So that's eight crit, four so, draw. If you draw a bunch of zeros, you can actually call these out and try to get, like, try to draw into rear guards. Yep. It gives your Vanguard plus five. It's, it's just like, it's a. Why not? Because you're running Thavas and you want to run eight crits anyway. And then four heals because if you're not running four heals, you're bad. Yeah. Um, yeah. So that's that. Now for the extra deck. Um, we played the Yugi Mans. So, these are the two I was running at the um, Spring Fest. He didn't want to run them? No. Uh, he was useful once, he was never useful. That makes but sense. The one game that he was useful, I would have won if I had two more of these guys. Uh, next. Wow, that's, that's, that's kind of upsetting. Yeah, it's a little upsetting, yeah. I was running two um, Thava Stride. I since got two more, I'm now running four. But at the tournament, I was only running two. Uh, he is absolutely ridiculous. Um, you uh, flip a copy of himself, pick something, it gets plus five and can attack from the back row. So, like I said before, the combos give her plus five, uh, and she swings twice in the back row. Or you could give it to a title assault, or you could just give something plus five because it's fun. And um, with two of them, um, he has Thavis' skill, where if uh, anything swings fourth, you pick three and retire something. Yep. Uh, you get to retire two things just for swinging. Uh, it's good. He's really good. And then four Lambros because it's one of the best cards in the game. Uh, if they're at five damage and you're on your first stride, you first stride in the Lambros and you win. Uh, after you stride Thavas, if they're not playing Link Joker or you have your front row unlocked, you stride into Lambros and win. You win. You win. It basically, if you're smart about it, whenever you stride into him, you should win. Uh, and you run two just in case they hit a six damage heal or something stupid. So you just do Lambros again next year and you win. It's Lambros. It's Lambros. He's really good. He's money. Yeah. He's good money. Worth every single penny. Yeah. Yeah. Play four, don't play less. Yeah, you can play it, Blue it, Wave. Blue is the only one that you can play two. And get Blue Wave with. you could play two. I play two because I have two Thavas, but if I didn't have two Thavas, I'd play four. Yeah. But yeah, that's, that's the deck. It did really well. Um, I played against... One Link Joker player. Did you um, win that one or did you lose that one? I won. Oh, you won? Uh, yeah, I had, the, I had the game from the beginning just because um, pure CBD puts on absolutely zero pressure. Yeah, early game, no. So I rode Skyros. I had a column of the resist grade one and he just didn't bother me. Um, I had a, he had a Volt line that kept Omega locking my title assault because he started Omega locking before I rode Skyros. Yeah. Um, that was the only game that Aristotle helped. But, but if you had another one of him. If I had another won. one of him, I would have won one turn earlier. So uh, he's just better, in, especially in this deck, he's a lot better because then, uh, because I was on Skyros, I could still use the Glimmer Breath alone. What did you lose to? I lost to one Shadow Paladin player because I didn't have enough guard to guard PB, uh, PBA. That Abyss? Yeah, Abyss, that one. Um, I lost to Gear Chronicle. <laughs> yeah. The first time, the, that, you know, that guy was a god. Um, yeah, but uh, our team only lost to the same team twice. The Gear Chronicle, right? Uh, well, he, one guy was playing Gear Chronicle, one guy was playing Saint Guard, and the other guy... The other guy was playing... <laughs> what? Um, Break Ride Mega Colony. Break Ride Dark Fist. <laughs> Yo, they were in the top two. I don't know how they did it, but they did. They were cool people. They're gonna make the body so upset. <laughs> they were top two. That's hilarious. I know. Oh, How are they making that for you? Just get break riding? I, no I don't know. No one had a great three? Joey played against him. I know Joey beat him, but oh my god. 
Yeah. Joey beat him once and then double got double cut. No, but he didn't care because you guys already lost. Yeah. He's like, oh, fuck yeah. it, no guard. Yeah, Gerald lost. Well, that's it. <laughs> All right, thank you, Ben. Thank you for the laughs. That was uh, Tavas and signing off. That was too